Hey guys, that's Adam aka Swimming Bird and welcome to Tomodachi Life. Oop, it's a new year and a new month and that means a new spot pass item. And Goofy here in the new studio. Samurai clothes, nice! So we usually get a lot of western items in this version of the game. There's Freddy Fazbear in his nice samurai outfit. In, in Japan, uh, New Year's, they actually dress up in more traditional formal clothing, so I think that's why we got that. So last time, we carved up some of that roast turkey from the one-day-only New Year's Eve sale, and we also passed out some cat suits to the Mario gang, although some of them were not very fond of it. Hey, there's Freddy. He put his hamster hat back on. What's up, Freddy? Let's play a game with him, because he seems a little happier than usual. What's going on? Oh, jeez. Usually if Freddy said that to me, I would not step into his uh, pizza room here. Me facts. Uh-oh, this is gonna be tough. I don't remember a lot. <laughs> uh, I think they might be. Maybe, I, Marceline's the one that's friends with Garfield, though, I thought. Let's see. Oh, we lost already. <laughs> okay, I should have gone with that. Oh well. Garfield's just really popular among the Adventure Time guys. All right, I think we're getting some toilet paper, or some tissues, okay. They usually give you some type of uh, toiletry for losing, but that's okay. Ooh, we got some people who want to make friends. I want to, uh, or they're having an argument. Oh no. Is it the Creeper and Poe, probably? And Dracula's having a nice little seance here with Velma and Cat Mario. I'm gonna go see what the news is today, though, before we go into any of those, uh, social things. We've got Epona here. She's dressed up all nicely. What's up, Epona? Napoleon Cake. The Terminator Bot. Perfect. <laughs> the Terminator Bot, which came out last year. In this action sequel, Defender of Justice, the Terminator Bot battles the evil monster Mecha Velma. It's the good Terminator. Okay. Star, the Terminator had this to say about the $200 million picture. It's a masterpiece. <laughs> That's so weird that Terminator just happened to be a robot. Creeper spreading the word. <laughs> Midna's in the know. That was so weird. Mecha Velma, not usually a character you <laughs> would see in any of the Scooby-Doo uh, show or movies. But Terminator Bot, that's pretty in line with the actual Terminator. Okay, so let's see. I guess we should check out what's going on here. Dracula wants to make new friends. Even though he's got a bunch of friends over at his little graveyard, he wants to make even more. So good to he's he's got to have more victims. <laughs> he's made two good friends with a few of them, so he can't, you know... Feed. Let's see. I think Peach and I have oh. become really good friends. Oh, have you? What do you think about me and Peach? Well, you are a count, and she. I think she's a princess. That would go I well, right? Agree more. I think so. Maybe you can take her to space in this space trip that hopefully he'll take eventually. Here, we got to start giving Dracula some more money, or he'll never go to space. Creeper and Poe are arguing, but I think we can handle that later. I want to check out. Peach is having a problem as well. Let's see what else is going on. Now, I want to do another song. It's been a while since we've done a musical number. So if you guys have any suggestions on who should sing a song, uh, post them in the comments. We've already had a lot of villagers sing, but we got to do some more of those. So let's see. A new hat. You already have a crown. What could be better than a crown? Okay, let's see if any of these would fit well on Peach. Not really. Oh, we have that, that woven hat that we really need to give to Marceline. Let's see. We could give Peach some uh, cat ears, but she already has cat ears. Or we could give her a flower. <laughs> Let's just, uh, she's not a Pikmin. I'll give her these cat ears, and she's got duplicates, basically, of the cat ears. And if she wants to put her cat, her cat suit back on, then, uh, that'll work. Now she can keep her crown and wear cat ears. There we go. She's, like, in between Princess Peach, sort of cat, sort of not. All right. Let's make her put that back. <laughs> I gave her the cat suit, if you remember, last time. And, uh, because she, yeah, the, the ears are different, if you look. Yeah, weird. Okay. Because uh, we gave her a mirror as well when she leveled up, she immediately changed outfits, so that was very sad. But now she's back in her cat clothes. So we have Cat Mario, Cat Peach, and then somewhere here... Oh, Bowser changed back as well. Bowser did not like his cat outfit. Let's play a game with him. He's unusually happy, but he might cheat because he is Bowser. Alright, what are we playing here, buddy? Hopefully it's uh, not a me quiz again. Cards! Oh, okay. We have to pick a card from my opponent's hand and make a pair. Let's try this one. Oh, we got it! Haha! -ha. Creepy children celebrate our victory. All right, <laughs> laughing at us. We did it. That was pretty easy. This is a 50/50 chance, I think. What do we got? Something good. I'm gonna go. I always go for the big present. I'm gonna go for the little one. Let's see what it is. Ooh, gold earrings. That's probably worth a lot. Okay, we get some more money here. 
All right, let me see uh, what else is going on. Bowser's doing push-ups immediately. He's trying to get swole. What is uh, Garfield up to flying around? A lot of these guys, I need some type of like litter box for Garfield. I have some interiors I could give people, but nothing that I think would fit certain ones. Oops, there we go. I'd like to eat some fruit. Garfield's nose, I just re realized, is like hidden between his uh, his forehead. That was weird. He wants some fruit, eh? Let's see. Well, we have a... That's a Sunday. We uh, we could give him... A durian is a fruit, right? They... I've heard they smell horrible. In the Animal Crossing, I, uh, people were talking about it. Because, yeah, I never actually like had one before. And a lot of people say they smell really bad. But some people like it. I think it's just really derisive. But I've never had one. I'll have to try one someday, maybe. There he goes. Garfield liked it. At least he'll eat anything. There's a slide puzzle. I hate those things. The slide puzzles... You would get them sometimes as a kid. Like, I would get them in a stocking sometimes at Christmas. And uh, just trying to... I don't know. There, there's strategy to it. But I could never, you know, figure it out easily. And just sli slid the pieces over and over until you finally get it right. Not really a fun game. Something, here to wear on my head. Something weird. She doesn't really have a crown. We need a crown for her. But I'm wondering what would fit with Flame Princess. She could have a crazy uh, curly locks. She could have a scarf. A horn. I don't know. None of these really seem to fit her. Let's just give her this <laughs> curly locks wig. We've had it for so long since that meeting. We had like a dream where oh, a bunch of characters like Waluigi and stuff were, were meeting and they all had wigs on. And oh, there she likes it. Okay. Hopefully it doesn't uh, burst into flames. But that's alright. We're getting close to a thousand here. We need 10,000 to send Dracula to space, I believe. So it's going to be quite a while before we can get him to go into orbit, but let's check out what else is going on. We gotta do the donation event. Let's see, little Mac gazing off in the distance. He has to stand on the bench because he's so short. And then Mothra is also looking up to the sky. Thinking of flying somewhere, maybe. Alright, we got Kiki Slider digging like a dog he should on the beach. <laughs> and then no one's at the cafe, surprisingly. I don't know if we should get those sa the samurai clothes are probably expensive. The Ooh, Sailor Moon selling Welcome. candy apples. I'm gonna buy some of those. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if, uh, if we should get the samurai clothes for anyone. Like, maybe someone would like them. I want to do the donation event, but everybody's just trying to peddle candy apples to me. I gotta wait, I guess, until that's not happening. Okay, what's going on at the... Ooh. Rosalina, where's Slenderman? Her husband, Slenderman, is nowhere to be found. And speaking of which, I almost never visit the, uh, the me homes here. Somebody's got a problem at one of them. I know, eventually, if we want to have, you know, one of these people have a kid... Then we're gonna have to go here. Oh, two princesses. The meeting of the princesses here. We've got Bubblegum and Zelda. Wow. This is Zelda's house. I'm sorry, I Zelda. Well. I'm sorry. Shh. <laughs> Let's, uh, oh, she's just hungry. Okay. She's not thinking about having a kid yet. Let's give her a whole roast turkey <laughs> since I bought a few of those. And uh, we don't want those to go bad. No, I don't think spood fo uh, spood foils. Uh, food spoils in this game. That would be really sad. Just off of leveling up. That's so crazy. She's yeah, like a sliver away, but she's still giving me something because that was in a delicious meal. Age of Matic, nice. Who sh should we age anyone up? Because we still have like Link, Pooh Bear, and uh, Finn. Finn needs to stay a kid though. That would be weird if Finn uh, aged up. I don't know. But he has done that in some ed uh, ep episodes of Adventure Time. He's had little like flashbacks and stuff. Party Man's got some trouble. What are you up to, Party Man? Let's see what his problem is. It's probably his ugly interior. <laughs> I gave him like an old like 60s, 70s interior and he, uh, it fits him, but, oh, we have not given him any clothes either. He should get some type of, he needs a suit, but I don't think we have any, uh, any formal suits for him. A track suit would be funny on him because he's kind of a, an aging, you know, salaryman guy. He could be a ninja. I'm just going to give him that track suit to uh to wear around here <laughs> that seems like something he would wear go out jogging and stuff but he needs like a business suit because he's a business guy there he goes all right he can go party in that and exercise a little bit he's got a bit of a belly just like mario he's kind of similarly built <laughs> to mario oak's got a problem what are you up to oak Just trying to help as many people as we can we should look at the interiors we have because i really need to like start giving out some wow. more gifts some more uh interiors and more clothing and stuff Samus is Professor Oak's best friend. Oh, jeez. Okay. He's got a Haramaki thing, like guarding it, but I'll look inside. Oh, it's empty. Is that a hint? Are you hungry? 
Yeah, I guess. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> Did I get some money? I, he gave me some money just for looking in his belly. I'm no doctor. Okay, let's give him a brand new candy apple and see how he likes it. Just a little treat to fill him up. Give him some energy to study. Some pokes. All right. He did love it. Okay, cool. All of his favorite foods are dessert. Since I need to, here, need to uh, feed him something more substantial or he's going to get like diabetes or something. All right. Let's uh, oh, play some football. Okay. So we have to tap this. Okay. My technique is to just tap my fingers, like both of them. I tap them back and back. There we go. Pretty good technique. You just push them off super easy there. Just kind of rattle your two fingers on the touch screen. All right. You, you are defeated. I still think that's got to be some type of sumo wrestling game or something. All right. Hotel toiletries. Okay. <laughs> some of this stuff, like, you wouldn't think would sell. That's got to be stolen from the hotel. Maybe Professor Oak stole it. Oh, creeper. Oh, no. I don't want to get in between an exploding creeper and Edgar Allan Poe. Poe's just going to read me some of his poetry and bum us out. And then the creeper's just going to explode, and that's a huge hole in the uh, me apartments that we have to repair. So I'm going to let them have it out, and we'll see what happens. So, I'd like a new hat. Bubblegum wants a hat too. All the princesses, they want hats. I don't know if we have anything that would fit. This would probably look good on Bubblegum. A little beanie to go with her kind of winter wear. And uh, it's purple, so it's kind of a little color. The crown sticks through it. <laughs> and speaking of hats, oh, and leveling up. We need to give Marceline that hat. Let's see what we can give Bubblegum here. How about, she needs something sciencey, like a bubble blower. <laughs> I don't know why I thought of that as a science type device. Does she have a laptop already? She does not. There we go. Now she can study stuff on the computer. Cool. Yeah, All right. I want you to have They're this. always giving me gifts back. They're so considerate. They're just bath sets though. They're giving me things that they want me to use on them, which is kind of funny. There we go. Marceline, you're not wearing your straw hat anymore. I got you a new hat. So hopefully this will be good. Here it's you are, um, my dear. Right at the bottom. I think this looks more accurate to the hat that she wears in Adventure Time. So we'll see how this looks on her. Oh, please. Yeah, she really likes it. Perfect. Okay. So she's good. I want to see what interiors we have. Oh, man. Let's Everybody's play playing game. games with me. They're just so sad that I haven't talked to them in a while. Okay. They want to play. Oh, the match game. This one... It's, it's funny to... There's Napoleon cake. Man, we just heard about Napoleon cake earlier. It's oh. <laughs> I like to hear them read out the different things. It's KK Slimer. It's a... It's, it's Jake. <laughs> Everything's Jake. There we go. That's Good easy. Alright. And it's I'm in here somewhere. <laughs> She's got... I just realized she has the it's little uh, fangs on Good her. Job. Aw. They managed to put the it's fangs Jake. on Marceline. Alright. We got it. I was... Nope. It's that was Kiki Slider. Slider. Luckily, we have five chances at this, so it's pretty easy Good to get job. everything. And then I'm in here somewhere, right? Some yeah. Good there job. we go. I had one more chance left. Luckily, Good I got job. all of them in time. You've been beat, Mausoline. All right. What do you got for me? Something good? I wanted to check the interiors, because, yeah, we got to start giving these out to more people. If I have a few saved. <gasps> got a big foam hand. Thank you very much. All right. So what do we have... A boy's interior. This looks like it would be good for like a Toy Story character. This empty one that I don't know if that works for anybody. European, exotic. Oh, I was going to give myself the gamer one. And then this humble one. I don't know who would fit in the humble one with the cardboard TV. Maybe some type of uh, traveling person. I don't know. Yeah. doesn't really look like it would fit a lot of these characters. So I was going to give myself the gamer one. I'm just hanging out, <laughs> pacing around with Shaq. I have this nice log interior. Is there another a video game character that would fit with the gamer one? <laughs> Slenderman can't get any reception because it's raining. Uh, I'm going to want to pick a, game, a video game character that I like a lot to give the game interior. There's Link walking around. Samus has her nice one. So many characters. Velma and Goofy. Ooh. Is Velma thinking about making new friends? I know that the Miis can get divorced, so you got to be careful if you don't keep their relationship healthy. She is married. I know, I'm sorry. Every time that somebody complains, I just pick them up. <laughs> yeah, you guys are both brainiacs, right? I think they're both uh, thinker type me's. Alright. Gonna brew up some drama though. <laughs> they might just be good friends, but uh, we'll see what happens there. Goofy, it seems like Velma would have a short patience with Goofy. Because he can, uh, did somebody just toot? I heard some tootin' somewhere in here. Alright, 
But yeah, it doesn't seem like Velma would have much patience for, uh, for Goofy. Oh no. The wild thing is hiccups. Let me see. Yeah, we're running out of game characters here that would, uh, work with that interior. It's anybody? Somebody's gotta take it. All these other ones have got some other interiors that work. Epona, I don't really think would fit, and like we fit trainer. I think I might just give it to my guy, cause I want to make him, uh, want to make him happy. He still needs to find someone. He has not found anyone, preferably Danny, that he's uh, he's gonna settle so down with here. Him. So we'll see. How about a nice? This one was super expensive, but it has a virtual boy, and it has Rob in there. I think Rob is on the shelf. So we can take a look around and explore. Look at that giant Game Boy. It's awesome. And the, the Nintendo logo comes down, so it's like a TV. Yes, for sure. We gotta take a look around. Okay. So there's that Game Boy. It just kind of scrolls the Nintendo logo. There's Rob. He's moving. <gasps> Rob. So cool. I had a Rob as a kid. It's still somewhere. There's a Famicom with a disc system, an NES, a GameCube. I can't make out with that one game. Oh, it's the one... Uh, scope thing. It's like a periscope thing. It's an old Nintendo toy. Then we got a ton of old Famicom games here. The gold cartridge Zelda up there. Looks like maybe the Duck Hunt combo. My head's in the way. So Lots of cool it? stuff. Arcade cabinets. Looks amazing. Oh, look at the carpet. It's the NES uh, <laughs> gamepad there. Alright. So I think that... Oh, we leveled up. Nice. We're at level 8. Man, I've got so much stuff. What else can I give my guy? Um, hmm... Maybe he... Well, we already had him sing a song. I just gotta give him something good. I, I have all this game stuff. I feel like my guy just needs to get out and uh, exercise a little bit more. Let's give him a skateboard. <laughs> this is not safe. I don't have a helmet, so shouldn't try this at home. I think he put they put on helmets when they go do that. All right. Well, so let me uh, know which guys do you want to see sing a song. We could do a group song or a solo song and what type of song you want to see. And then uh, next time we'll do a musical performance. It's been a while. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. And uh, I'll see you guys then for more Tomodachi Life. Goodbye.